making a winter squash soup today. Uh, what we're going to do is use the acorn squash. It's very seasonal, great little item. Uh, we're going to start out by making a base for the soup using a roux and some chicken stock. So we're going to take a little bit of our clarified butter and some flour. We're going to combine that over here. What we want to do is form a medium paste. So let's put those together. And then I'm just going to give it a little bit of a stir. I'm going to let that start to cook. Looks like I need a little more flour. What we're going to want to do is bring this up to what's called the blonde stage, which means that it starts to turn a little bit white and has a light, nutty aroma to it. While the roux is working, we're going to start the base for the soup with the stock, some onions, and a little bit of garlic. I'm just going to turn that down and let that go. For the onions, you just want a kind of a smallish dice, nothing too fancy. Get those in the pot, let those start to caramelize a little bit with a little bit more butter. And just a little bit of the garlic. starting to brown just a little bit already. We had our pan nice and hot to start out. Once those caramelize and soften up a little bit, we're going to add our chicken stock. And uh, you can just buy that right off the shelf of the store. You can make your own, whichever you prefer. We're going to bring that to a simmer. Once that gets to a simmer, we'll take the roux. We're going to add that to the stock. Just like that. Give it a little stir. That'll thicken right up for you. So once that thickens, it'll look like this. So it'll have a nice, smooth, creamy texture to it. That's the base for your soup. So we'll just leave that on low, let that just kind of simmer away. We're going to take our acorn squash, we're going to roast them in the oven. Now what you want to do is cut them open sideways. They're a little hard to get through, so be careful not to cut yourself. Pop your seeds out. And then those go in the oven for about a half an hour at 350 degrees, give or take a little bit. When they come out, they're going to look like that. So they'll be nice and soft. You see they're good and squishy. We're just going to scoop that right out of there. Take all the meat out. We'll put that right into the soup. That'll break up for you quite easily. Use a whisk. If you need to let it simmer a little bit more to, to get good and smooth the way you want it, that won't take very long at all. See it's taking on that nice yellowish color to it. After this is simmered for a bit, it'll be ready to go. And we're going to bring it over to plate up. And I took another squash and we just hollowed it out the other direction to make a cup. And so what we'll do is just go ahead and pour that right into the cup. You can hold that squash hot, serve that to your family, serve that to your guests. You've got a great little wintertime dish.